Hi guys. Spotted this pump action fan in the I can't remember which one it was, Poundland or 99p store, one of the bargain stores. And when I saw it I thought that'd be a very easy way to make a DC generator. Because I've got a little electric motor from a vibrating toothbrush. If I take the fan blade off here, I've got a bit of um, insulation off of some power cable. I've cut a short length that just happens to be a good tight fit on there. It's also a good fit on there, so they're joined together. And if I just connect that LED onto there, if that just holds steady enough. Sounds to me like I'm breaking the gears in there. <laughs> so don't buy these from wherever I bought them from. Looks like the plastic gears inside are not very strong. <laughs> what a lovely cracking sound. But I think you can see the LEDs working, even though the pump is broken. <laughs> yeah. I think that's given up the ghost now. But I think it worked long enough for us to see that it worked. Let's have a quick look inside, see what state that's in. They've started to strip along the edge there. But on the positive side, I've got a good load of gears there that I can use for other projects. So that's brilliant. That's a good set of gears there. So that plastic has given up the ghost already. I've got a gearbox there that I can use. That's great. So not much good as a fan because it 
that plastic doesn't last very long. But that could be another project for me, a gearbox. Yeah. So, there we go, a bit of a sidetrack there. A little DC generator, enough to light the LED. And we've now got a gearbox of useful bits. Job done.